Happy New Year everybody. Welcome to my channel, The Jewelry Pirate. This is Barbara. I was watching some videos earlier today and a lot of people are saying that there's no videos out there the last couple of days. So, I figured I'd come on and do a little video for you for New Year's. And also, I've been waiting, I think it's almost two weeks, for a package to come from um, Robin at my Skywatch. And I have that here. I'm going to open that up. And I'm going to give you a link to her channel um, in the section below the video. Please make sure you check her channel out. Um, she's really nice. She's very calming. She goes over the jewelry. Really, really, really good. You have, you have a great description. And um, she's very, very nice. So give her a shot if you're not already a member of her channel. I'm sure you'll enjoy what you see over there. Okay, so the big thing is... Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. That's very important. Let's make a New Year's Eve re um, resolution that um, we should hit the thumbs up button. So that's important, like I said. And then you want to share. If you have friends that like jewelry and you think that they might like the channel, share the video with them. They would, might like to subscribe to the channel. And then also subscribe. If you're not already a member and you're watching this video, think about subscribing to our small little family um, channel here. And um, don't forget to hit that bell. This way you'll be no notified when I upload a new video. Okay, so let's get started. I've been waiting, I, I, like I said, I think it's about two weeks for this to come, and I'm going to open this. What this is, um, is a package of um, findings. It's not really jewelry. Um, I saw this, and I saw a lot of cute little things in here that I can wrap some pendants, and also, um, I'll show you the bag. I'm not going to take everything out because it's a lot of little beebs and bobs and stuff, and I'll have it all over the place. But, um, you know, things that I can use in hopefully repairing, um, making, adding on. I have a bucket here that I keep that I have items in. Um, so I'll go through this and sort it out. All right, so let me open this up. Hang on. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh wow. Well, I didn't expect this. This is what what my little package evidently comes in. Robin, thank you so much for this. This is this is unbelievable. So let's open it up. You can tell I'm almost in tears. Okay, and there's a little note in here. I'm going to put that over here. Thank you, Robin. Thank you so much. Okay. Now I'm shaking. Okay. This is all the baubles and beads and stuff like that. Things that can be added on to. There's some... Um, cameos in here. I have some bezels that I know I can set some of those cameos in. And there's just pieces in here, like I said, that can be added on to different things that I have. But I have to sit down and I have to sort it out. So I'll have fun going through this. So thank you, Robin. I'm glad I finally got it. Um, the, the, the postage has been absolutely horrible. And speaking about that, um, I have three of you that are going to be getting a package soon. I'm hoping that I can get 
those packages out tomorrow. If not, they will definitely go out on Monday. Okay. So anyway, let me show you this little little treasure chest here. It's hard to see. Let me put my light on. So I got to clear some space out now to make some room on here and I put some special items in here to surprise you guys with. This is so adorable. There's my little skull and crossbones. It even has the little things on the side. It just feels satiny. Oh my God. Thank you. It's basically my first piece of any kind of friend meal that I've ever gotten. Thank you again, Robin. Okay, so I don't have a lot here. I'm going to probably go through a few things. Um, if you see anything you like, let me know. And I'm mainly doing the video today to give you guys something to watch because, like I said, I've been hearing a lot of people saying, there's not much out there to watch. Well, Robin's got stuff out there to watch. So, all right. I'm not going to take a lot of this out of the bag, but some of it I will. All right. I have a lot of really good stuff coming up shortly. Um, later on today, there's going to be, if you like that black and white bag that I had, which I haven't processed yet, there's going to be another bag like that with even... Um, some really nice things in that too. All right, so here I have, this is a little bracelet. It's gold tone. And um, it's a stretch. It's very comfortable to wear. So we have that. And um, there's a lot of little things here. I'm going to try to put these all together. Okay, so there's that. I have up here, these are posts, a pair of, um, these are um, a coral color, and they have rhinestones going all the way around. They're posts, brand new, sealed in the package. They're not, they're not cheesy. Um, they got a little weight, but they're not going to kill your ears wearing them. And I have a nice little cuff. Okay, this is a hammer. It's hammered, and um, it's cute. Finished off nicely. Okay, we have that. All right. I have a um, a puka shell necklace with elephants, and um, these are nice polished pieces of puka in the shape of hishi beads. And there's your elephants. And uh, by the way. Mostly everything here is very reasonable. Okay, so that's cute. Okay, here we have, these are real pearls, believe it or not. And I think this is choker length. Let me see if I can measure this. Um, this is like 15 inches. And these are real pearls. And then it has um, this neat little lock and key type um, toggle clasp and some seed beads at the end. So this is cute. I have a pair of um, hoops by Charming Charlie, brand new on the card. Um, they have all kinds of little shell dangles hanging down below. These are very cute. All right. Let's see what this one is. Okay. This is um, very pretty. Uh, where's, where's Buster? Come here, Buster. This is a little... Um, Chaton necklace. Um, you're not gonna, you're not gonna be easy to see this, but um, these, these are eternity um, symbols, and then they have the chatons on here. Okay, it's very long. I would say it's probably, I don't know, 30 inches, maybe, maybe a little more. For my ladies that like delicate stuff, this is a perfect 
perfect, perfect necklace. I hope everybody stayed in last night and didn't go out and indulge too much. Alright, this is very cute. This is very, very delicate, very old-fashioned. Um, let me show you this on Buster. I don't usually take take these out, but this is, this is adorable. Somebody wants something. This has got... Um, these are, I'm, I think these are stone. I'm not sure if they're glass or plastic, but it's on a very antique uh, Figaro chain. It's going to hang quite a ways. It has a um, lobster claw. It's antique brass, I would say, dark. And it's very, very pretty. Put it in my hand, give you a close-up. There you go. And some of it's cold and some of it's not. All right, we'll put that there. Oh, let's see what this beautiful thing is here. For all you that like um, rope chains. And I think, I can't tell and I don't know where my loop is. Here it is. This is Avon. This is very, very, very pretty. This has got a beautiful, beautiful rope chain on it. Very long. For my friends that like the hearts, this is a little pink. I think it's porcelain. And it's surrounded by pearls. There's the back, there's the Avon. Really super nice rope chain. Give you a close up of the pendant. No extender, but you're not going to need it. You don't even need a clasp. This is so long and so pretty. Okay, so we have that. They were setting fireworks off here last night after New Year's. My doggies don't like fireworks. Not at all. Not at all. The cat took off and ran upstairs, then he came downstairs, and he went behind the couch. He's one of the worst. There's these earrings. They're posts. These are enamel. They're very cute. Okay. Maybe I won't get through all this stuff on here. I don't know. Hmm. We'll see. Okay. This I'm not going to take out. This has a twisted... Um, it's the way it's supposed to be. This is gorgeous. It's almost like a very pale green teardrop pendant. I put this on a card so that the um, chain wouldn't get tangled. I would imagine it's at least 18, 20 inch chain on this. Um, all the rhinestones are in it all the way around and it's beautiful if you're interested in that. Here's all your chain. Oh. Now this, I think, is a set. Yes, it is. This is absolutely gorgeous. And this is definitely glass. All right, let me put this on. It's gold tone, and these are all um, like a teardrop shape bead. And they have a really beautiful finish on them. It's not showing up in the camera. And there's actually a pair of shepherd hook earrings that go along with this set. 
So let me give you a close-up. Maybe you'll be able to see the finish on these beautiful beads. Um, they sparkle like you wouldn't believe. They're beautiful. There you go. There's a good way of seeing it. Okay. So they finally all settled down after a while. And then we were able to go to sleep. Okay. I have a... This is, I'm pretty sure, memory wire. But it's nice. It's all shell. And it's purple. Very, very nice. And it fits the way that it looks continuous. That you're not going to see where it opens up in the back. It's really very nice. Um, and it's finished off with... If you look on this, I'm going to try to get them to hang out. But it's finished up with all these little beads, which is really nice. This is a nice bracelet. Very nice bracelet. Okay, put that back away. A lot of nice things in here. Well, that ain't going to go in so easy right now, so we're going to put that over here. All right. I have another pair of post earrings. These look like lightning bolts. These are very pretty. They're in gold tone. And they have like a, a green stone down at the bottom. You see right down here on the bottom? A very pale stone. These are very pretty. Different. Okay, so there's those. These next ones I don't have to take out of the bag because you can see them. These are cute. And I'm looking to see if they're signed on them. All these earrings have their backings on. Now, St. Patrick's Day. We're over the first of the year. St. Patrick's Day is coming up. Here's a really cute, cute pair of four-leaf clover enameled earrings. Sorry about that. So they all have their clutches. These are very cute. Okay. Got some set of pearls here. I don't know exactly what they are. These are old. Yes, these are older. And they're in nice shape. I'm going to put them on Buster. And they're graduated. Okay, see here. Your clasp is here. It's one of the ones that you push in and out. You have three pearls on this on this pretty, pretty, pretty clasp. You don't have to wear it this way, but I just put it on here in this it's twisted around so and um I don't know. They're not um hand knotted, but they're also not all the same in size. Hmm, I'm not sure on these ones. There's the back of the clasp. Here's the front. Okay, let me show you these. They're beautiful. They have a really nice finish. I don't see any problems with them. Okay, so we have those. I take these things out of the bag and then they don't want to go back in. Okay, let's see what else I have here. Um, let's pull some of the stuff that's over here so I know it's out of the way and done with. We might have to come back and do the rest of this later. All right, have a nice cup. I don't know if this has a, yes, this has a signature on it. Now I can't see, even with the, the loop. Wow. Maybe I'm going blind. I think it says sugar fix, I think. But here it is. Very pretty. Okay. 
All right, let's see what this is. This has, um, all right, this is a necklace. Put it on Buster. It's costume, but it's very pretty. Um, there's all these different uh, things that hang down here. Um, it's lightweight. And it's cute. You want something easy to wear. All right. For some reason my light is not doing its job today. That's all the back. There's the front of the pendants. Okay. All right. There's some really interesting things here. Put this over there. Now this is a beautiful cup. It's well made. Um, it's glass and rhinestones. Uh, I don't see any signature on it, but this is quality. Okay, let me show you this. And then it comes over to these, the black stones. And I'll bring it up close so you can see what I'm talking about. All right. All right, should we show you this? Let me get it in focus here. Okay, in the middle there's rhinestones. And then on the outside of those there's gold. Everything else is silver. And those are black faceted beads, glass beads that are in there. This is well made. Okay, this is not garbage. And it's beautiful. All right. You know I always try to wean out the real uh, not so wonderful stuff. Now this is I think a choker. Yes it is. And uh, this is all seed beads. Oh my god, this is pretty. This is lightweight. But you don't want a choker to be. It's got all rhinestones running through it. It's got a long extender. Let me get this so you can see this up close. Hopefully you'll be able to see what I'm talking about. Last time I had a couple of chokers, they were gone in a second. And they weren't anywhere near as nice as this one is. This is very pretty. Okay. Put that away. Where are we at on time? We're doing good. Okay. This is a very beautiful pendant. I'll take it out. It's got a very long chain. All right. It's crystal, it's glass, as far as I know. Feels cold. Okay, and then you've got the stones right up at the top of where the pendant is here. And then a very, very, very long chain. I mean long. You could double this. Alright, so. Very pretty. All right, let's see. This has got to go back in here. We don't have a lot left, I don't think. I'm going to try to make it through it. All right. Um, there's earrings in here. These are pearl earrings. They're really cute and delicate and dainty. And same thing with these. And they're, These are on shepherd hooks. Um, pearl. And these ones are on a post. Let's see if I can take one of these out. These are adorable. These ones here. Okay, if you can see that. Very pretty. So those, we have those two pairs of earrings. And I have a pair of these are lever back 
posts. Let me see here. These are pretty. These are purple and pink. They have some weight to them. Right now I'm just trying to determine. I can't get them out of the bag right now. They feel cold, so I think they're stone. All right. They're like splatter. And there's the posts and the lever backs. So you know these aren't going to come off once you put them on. They're very pretty. And I have a pair of large hoops with um, black and white seed beads that go all the way around. And these are very pretty. And these have a wire. They don't have that thing that the the post goes inside. These are really cute earrings. I say they're about the size of a silver dollar, maybe a tiny bit larger. All right. And we have these. These I think I'm going to, even though they don't totally match, um, these are purple, like little flower earrings, but they match that bracelet pretty close. And then I have these posts, um, I think these are plastic, but they kind of go good with these here. I don't know if you can see that. It's hard to show you. So they're little posts with a little ball dangling off of them. All right, now we have this necklace. This is an old-fashioned style necklace. This is really pretty. It's like the other one I showed you. This one here has got a lot of stuff on it also. All right, here's the... It's all chips. There's some wooden beads. There's glass beads. There's, um... Looks like carnelian on here. And it goes quite a ways. There's some quartz. Some rose quartz. Uh, I think this might be a piece of agate up here. There's a piece of citrine. Um... This is very cute. Again, this is another one that's got uh, like an antique brass. Very delicate, lots of cha-cha, lots of movement. This is absolutely beautiful. Okay, and that's definitely got an 18-incher on it, chain. You know, I have a lot of people that want something that's delicate and small. You know, that they can wear to work every day. You know, they don't want the big glam pieces. And this is really, it's earthy, you know, with all this, the natural stones in it. It's got some bicones. All right, so we have that. Um, now I have, I'm not going to take this out. This is a Howlite stretch bracelet. I know the stretch is good. And here's a pair of Howlite earrings, posts. I'll put them in the bag. They can go together. Alright, nice set. Okay, what else we got here? Let's see what this is. This is a very lightweight um, chain. It's on a barrel clasp, but it's pretty. It would be great for a nice pendant. There you go. It's long, and it's a combination of a silver and a gold. And it's like a rope chain. Very, 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 very pretty. I'll give you a quick close-up of it. I'm going to have to clean this up here so I can put my treasure chest from Robin up here. That's going to be uh, a feat all in itself. Here you go. Very, very pretty. Okay. And... What else we got? Oh, we got a beautiful, um, beautiful pendant here, and it's a locket. Let me see where this opens up. Let me get my fingernail in here. Okay, there's your locket. You can see the condition on the inside is beautiful. This also has a nice chain. This is a, looks like a porcelain bead up here. And this is the face. Right there of the locket. It's enameled. And it's very pretty. 
and give you a close up. Come on. And what do we got on there, birds? It's it's hard to tell, but it's very pretty. Okay, so we have that. We're up to 30. We're doing all right. This is just a, a black necklace, um, brand new. Um, these are all balls, filigree balls. Really cute. And I think there's a, yes, there's a pair of earrings in there to match that. Um, this is a great necklace right here. This has got some weight to it. Let me see if I can get this on Buster. And this is, it's made so well. Now this is just out of the bag. You have ones that are very shiny and then ones that have more of a matte finish on them. Three strand has weight. This is a really long, it's twisted. Nice extender and it's got the same bead on the end of the extender that's on the necklace. And this is very well made, high quality necklace. Okay, and put that back in the bag. Here you go. This is really nice. Okay. I know I haven't processed the, um, um, the what is it, the white tie and tails thing, black tie and tails thing yet. I'll do that after the other, this video and the other video probably tomorrow. Okay, now this is really pretty. Um, I don't know what this is made out of, but it's really, this is um, gunmetal. Let me get the chain in the right place. Um, it's a single chain up to a point and then it goes into a double chain. This is the pendant. A lot of pretties in there. That's the back of the pendant. I don't know if it's plastic, resin, all right, but it's all gunmetal and it's got a great extender on it with the kind where you have um, multiple different size holes that you can put your clasp into so you don't have to worry about trying to stick the lobster claw into um, a small piece of this is beautiful. Piece of um, chain. So we have that. Almost to the end. All right. I know I keep saying that. Uh, this uh, this is um. Let me get this out. This is pretty. This is um, a pearl. It's got a pink pearl on it. This also has a twisted. I think it's a twisted herringbone. Um, has a pink pearl inside and you can take this right off of there if you have a, a different colored pearl you can interchange them um, the chain is nice it says BKCP on the chain 18 karat gold plated so very nice piece all right, put that back in the bag. All right, I have a pair of bangles here. These are um, egg-shaped, by the way, and they're turquoise. They would go with um, anything southwestern, so they're not totally round. All right, we have those. Okay, now this is a silver tone chain with, um, it's two, two chains, and uh, let me put this in the right place, I want to put this on Buster, 
I don't know if you've ever seen any of this jewelry before. Maybe a couple pieces. Okay. All right. I don't know if you can see this very good or not. I have to get this um, all. These are glass, I'm pretty sure. Maybe not. They feel cold. This is, you can see it's purple. All right. And it's encased in this pretty pendant and uh, it's two strands again very pretty okay uh, I think we got that there's a really pretty pair of hoop earrings here on a shepherd hood hook with opaline colors and all kinds of pizzazz on these. These are beautiful antique brass. Um, I have a bracelet. This is this bracelet. And with this colored stones. It's got an extender on it. And it has a lobster claw clasp to close it with. It's very pretty. I don't see a name on it. It's well made. Okay, so again, we have that. Huh. Somebody's into um, some boho tribal stuff. I have this. This is a lightweight necklace. But it's really pretty. Uh, this I would take and I would torsade it. It's multiple lengths of minute wooden beads in purple. It's very, very, very nice. It doesn't look quite as purple as it is in person. All right, but it's 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 made well, and um, it's got such fluidity. It's really beautiful. There's the um, closure. It's a hook closure. All right, so we have that. There's just a couple more things here. I probably I'm getting everything piled up here. I have a bangle. Not a, yeah, I guess a stretch bangle in purple. That would match that necklace really nice. I don't know if you can see that. It's really pretty. Okay. And here is a multi-strand pearl drop necklace. And this looks interesting. Let's see what this is. Okay, we have this. This are um, like a teal blue. Okay, pretty pretty beads on this. As far as the spacer beads go, very intricate work on them. It's just a costume necklace, but it's it's pretty. Okay, and. Uh, Got a pair of earrings here, enameled posts. They're in, these are good good juju to wear these because they're in the shape of a pyramid. All right, so these these have good juju. All right, and then I think this, and we have a we have a a necklace of all silver circles. It's long. And then this is the last one I'm going to take out of the bag. This is also a set. Um, see if I can get this out and show it to you. This is very long. Sorry about that. Reed's just coming back in um, with the with the dogs, the big dogs. This is Premier Design. Let me show you this. How pretty this is. I'm going to try to put this on Buster 
and it has a pair of matching earrings with bows. And I'll show you those. It's hard to do this when they're so long. But premier design. And here's the earrings. Okay, so that's it. Anyway, I hope this little New Year's video should brighten your day up. It's nothing more than that, just something to give you something to do. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. And again, Robin, thank you so much. You really um, touched me with your little gift. And I appreciate it more than you know. So anyway, I make sure, everybody, that you go over there and check her out. Again, you see this? Thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. We're at 40 minutes. I have to get going. And I will see, there will be a video again, like I said, later on um, this evening. And that will be the completion, basically, of that. Uh, I think this one's called Lovely to Look At. But it's a continuation, kind of, of the white, black, and a little bit of red um, routine. So, anyway, I hope you all had a wonderful New Year. And um, let's hope that this new year is going to bring a lot of hope and health and prosperity back to all of us. And hopefully this virus will finally hit the road. Okay, everybody. Take care. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.